National Association of Sea Dogs, popularly known as Pirate Confraternity, has been caught on camera mocking the presidential candidate of the ruling All Progressives Congress APC, Bola Tinumbu. In a video circulating on social media, the group could be heard taunting the former Lagos governor over his speech in Ogun State, where he said in Yoruba that President Muhammadu Bari should hand over power to him because it is his turn to rule Nigeria. Dressed in white and red attire, members of the Pirate Confraternity mocked Timbu for shouting a milokon, which means it is my turn, despite his failing health. They were singing and shouting. This video has generated mixed reactions on social media with Timbu's critics teasing the ruling party candidate why followers of the APC chieftain condemn the ads. Emilokon, Emilokon, Baba we know well. In the shouts, Emilokon, hand the shake, leg the shake. Baba we know well. In the shouts, Emilokon. Well, uh, this uh, election is going to be dirty. I think uh, Tinubu is even ready. I think uh, there's a place he, he talked to, talked about a, uh, or talked to his uh, followers that he's surprised that his followers are always uh, angry or some people are always bitter when people insult him, throw jabs at him and all of that. That is used to it, that he's been in politics, that that is what is really expected. And don't forget, one time he said he will fight dirty. So, whether that was what he said, but he talked about it being dirty. So, he has been in this whole thing before now. And the rest people too, uh, they are coming for them. The other candidates, they will bring all manner of things against them as well. So, that is a politics for you. By next month, which happens to be September, a lot of things will be unfolding when the campaign will start proper. They then release another banger for Agbado Master, Emiloko, Emiloko. Uh, of course, we can see them in the video over the say hand the shake, leg the shake. <laughs> well, people are reacting differently. Of course, you don't expect a people to be happy especially his supporters i could remember when they were talking about a uh, obituary i think that obituary the supporters of a uh, obisef didn't even raise an alarm like that not until the person that even brought the whole thing the journalist or uh, that even brought this whole thing it was the one who was crying that they threatened him that was when people started saying oh, oh when you were doing talking about obituary what did you think what did you what did you mean uh -huh. so that is just how it is. Okay, I have to put this out. I don't even represent or promote whatever the people in the above video stand for. I endorse the message they pass with the song 100%. Tinubu way, nowhere cannot be Nigeria president. That is selfishness. Tinubu is not fit to be president. Okay, my people, this is a remix of the Aguado song. This will be our national anthem. Henceforth, uh, use as ringtone and in play it's in your rallies. Okay, Tinubu went nowhere. Can never be our president. Reject Tinubu and everything he represents. He took get uh, what's this on the talk? <laughs> he took get uh, how this uh, OT just the, the go. How is it going? How do you think it's going? A lot of things, a lot of intrigues will be coming. Okay. 
a lot of intrigues a lot of intrigues with uh, all this uh, this whole thing let's see how this whole thing oh god okay <laughs> see baba no way nowhere the whole thing is just out there for everybody to see uh people will judge they will judge but at the end of the day one thing that remains is that nigerians are suffering that is the most important thing if nigerians are suffering who is going to uh repair the country who is going to do the right thing that is where the question lies everybody say oh i'm going to do it i have the capacity to do it i'm capable of doing it we have had such messages in the past at the end of the day all to no avail they are still telling us that it is our fault it is those who voted for them that is their fault. Oh, things are fine. I think uh, this uh, journalist, uh, Baba Jide, he said, Buari will never accept that uh, he has failed. He will never accept it. That's why they are telling you that uh, the banditry and the Boko Haram that are terrorizing farmers, that it has never even reduced uh, or it has not brought a, uh, it didn't affect the food supply in the country they are telling you infrastructure they have done where they said the security is top notch they have done better than a uh, other or the past governments and nigerians say oh that is not the way it is i think uh, this man still came out to dissociate himself that is not a member of the confraternity uh, professor Walisha Higa. of course that is the right thing to do everybody you see association of uh, this and this and that. Oh, we support this person. Association this and this and that. We support this person. That is what is going to be happening between now and February. The next year that the election is going to be taking place. So, let's wait and see. Let's watch carefully and see where the whole thing will turn to. Everybody which is our own fan. Let's see how it goes. So, guys, let's hear your opinion and have your take on this. Thank you. <laughs>